the, the newest thing that's going on, everybody's heard and talked about butterfly jigs and butterfly fishing. So we're going to take a piece of fluorocarbon, tie a small hook, snail the hook on, and we're going to use live pilchard, any live bait fish that we've got. And we're going to drift with that, all right? A very good way of catching fish. You must use Kevlar line. You've got to use spectra of some sort. Braided line, 40, 50, 60 pound. He drops it down. Normally fishing two, 300 feet, you drop it down and you're making a wine like turn the handle once. Okay, and what, do you, what are you jigging? You're jigging something of this nature right here. There's a million different brands on the right. market and these are all designed with a double hook. The line attaches to the top and it lays like that. We've actually started with a few people, we don't broadcast it. We're taking a circle hook, opening the eye mm -hmm. and putting it on the back end. And we're hooking our fish on the back end also. They used to say that you had to hook just do it this way. We know for a fact you can catch them on the bottom hook also. Okay, so when that lure is in the water, what happens that, is that's the way it is. The, the, the weight of the jig swims, swims. Right. Okay, so when you come up, it falls. Come up, it falls. Normally, you'll get your bite on the fall. Right. Okay, another little secret we're doing. I don't like it as much because I don't sell as many. <laughs> but we'll go ahead and put a a trace of leader wire like number six, seven, eight wire, a little heavier so it doesn't kink, about a one foot long, and then tie a piece of fluorocarbon, 50, 60 pound, eight, 10 foot long, so we've got nothing in, in the water that you see easily. So the, the variety of fish in this water column is from bottom to top. So what you do with the depth finder of the boat marking the fish, you normally try to get on the bottom downside of the current of the wreck, drift up over top, and fish the column where you mark the fish on the depth finder. You get out of them, you don't catch any fish, you turn around and go back. When we're running offshore, look for your birds, look for your debris, but the most important thing is right on your dashboard is your temperature change. Right. You find that half a degree or one degree temperature change, that's the edge. You, mm -hmm. just, went, you just didn't see a bird, you didn't see debris. Work that edge. Now another little secret we found, say we fish for two hours, we catch fish after fish after fish, and they shut off. Why did they quit biting? Well, process of elimination is what you learn. The tide changed. Right. Hour before the tide, hour during, and the hour after the current stopped. Fish dissipated, the bite shut off, and you catch any fish. The tide changed, the current started going the other way, sat up on the other side, do a drift, fish after fish. <sighs> Okay. For more videos like this, go to sunsentinel.com.